get to hear me now Okay. Hobby, you need to hurry. Hello, Hobby. I'm giving you shit. Okay. I'm just. You weren't here when Dad was sick. Okay, I get it, but you need to fucking be here when he goes. I know. All right, I'm just on my way. <sighs> hey guys, Teneth here. Last episode of The Walking Dead, we went into Wellington, and now it looks like we're back at the very start of the zombie David, apocalypse. David, hey. Hey, David, I had to leave my car. It's, traffic's just it's backed up for miles. He's dead. No, no, I, I, I tried. You're a piece of shit, you know that? Gee, thanks. One time. Just the one goddamn time that you needed to be here. God, I hate this look, mouse look, now. I understand you're angry, but please. Angry? Oh, I'm more than angry, Hobby. <laughs> Everyone's here. They've been here for days. And where the fuck were you? <laughs> we're there, all around him. People who love him, all around him. <laughs> and he's scared. I'm seeing the panic in his eyes, and he's searching the room. Donde está Javier? Donde está mi hijo? I'm there, right beside him, holding his hand, like a good son. Gee, he thanks. doesn't even see me. He doesn't even see me because he's looking for you. You don't think there's a million places we'd rather be? Right, there's that. My dad too. All right. I mean, you're not. You're not the only one dealing with this. And what a fine son you turned out to be. Uncle Javi. Why? Why are you fighting? I could hear you from inside. It's nothing. We were just, uh, huh? talking, Gabriel. Right. Your uncle and I are just having a little chat. Go inside, mijo. We'll be in in a minute. Go on. It's okay. Inside. Gee, you can tell him one's authoritarian and one's not. I should call someone, pick up the body. Yeah. I love you, little brother. You know that, right? I know. Everything going on. Uh, that's a good answer. I know. You think I was jealous of you? No, I, I don't think anything. Well, I was. For a long time. Well, this is. You've lost more than I'll ever have. This is at least. But maybe something good can somewhat come Somewhat of out a good emotional this. start for these characters, I guess. Because we need <clears throat> you here. It's time to grow up. You Try being nice, or I'm not staying. I know you're right. I know. You're right. I won't even argue. I'll be around more, honestly. You can count on it, huh? I want to believe that. I do. Gee, can't you give your younger brother a benefit of the doubt? Kate. I'm so sorry, Harvey. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Let's go inside. Your mom needs you. What happened? Traffic happened. Come on. That's that's the answer. Traffic happened.
mamá. Where were you? No, I was expecting that. I tried. I tried. I'm so sorry. He's gone, mijo. He's gone. <laughs> He's in a better place, mama. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Where did you get those? And I'm like, I was smart. I wanted to buy them. I'm back. No puedo conectarme. Dicen que no hay servicio. This okay? Thirsty baby, you want some juice? Grandpa's cup was empty. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. People's awake. <laughs> oh, that that's gonna just scare the crap out of the grandmother. That, that sounded like a zombie, that's for sure. <laughs> yep, he's a zombie. Well, you saved your brother. That, that's the point. Of course, I'm going to get punched for... We need to go. We need to get her to the hospital. Well, let me look at it. Let me look at it. Gabriel, where's your sister? Oh, well, that's it. That's bad. Keys! Where the fuck are the keys? Take Dad's car. The keys are on the dash. <laughs> Mama, get the kids. Meet at the hospital. Don't take the highway. It's blocked. I'll bring the van around. Where's Mari? I, I don't know. Mija. Mariana! From the stars! Mariana, we have to go. Yaya's hurt. Come on, honey. We have to go. No, no, no! Gee, that sounds a little like Clementine earlier on no. in the series. General Hospital. I know the way. Oh, he got bit. Hello. It's early on. They don't know. It was early on, the very start of the zombie apocalypse. They wouldn't have known a bite equals death. All they saw was their grandfather brought back to life, Sylvie. Well, pastel, same person. Oh, hello, zombie horde. 
Yeah, I'd, I'd agree that would be present day. <clears throat> Tell me when it reaches the campfire. Uh, I've, I've... Come on, where's my mouse? There's my mouse. I don't think I've seen this many. It's definitely growing. Yeah, not a great sign. Oh, they're at the campfire. Damn it. I left my water bottle. Her just got there. Bored. Just under four hours. Come on. We should keep moving while the kids are asleep. That's true. Yeah. Well, he's not turning anyone. It looks like the herd is speeding up a little. I thought it was drifting southwest, but I'm not sure anymore. Every time I think we should just bed down somewhere and wait for it to pass, I can't shake the thought of us getting caught in the middle of it. It just keeps coming. It's if slow, we but that almost makes it worse. Down. Yeah. Makes it feel like we're in control. We keep moving. But you keep moving. It worked for us so far. As long as we stay supplied, we're fine. But it's not a pet. Yeah, maybe you're right. The van isn't so bad. We'll figure it out. We always do. Hey, I'm gonna sneak a smoke. I can't believe you found weed. Are you kidding? People were probably growing this before they realized they needed food. That's cool. Uh, don't wake the kids. All right, just, you know, make it quick. I don't want you waking the kids. Relax. Mariana's got headphones on and Gabe is drooling. I think we're in the clear. You want some? No thanks. Nah, no thanks. One of us should be sober. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> don't judge me. When I found out David had kids, I told him, I am not changing who I am around them. <laughs> and when he proposed, I reminded him that I'm not exactly stepmother material. <laughs> Case in point. He was reassuring, but you know, I could tell he was worried about it. I knew he'd try to get me to change. <laughs> or at least he'd hope that being around the kids more would change me, you know? Uh, David was stubborn. It did. He was always stubborn like that. Even when we were kids. He saw the world in a certain way. And he'd try and make you see it that way too. That's so that's, that's where he gets it from. I used to talk shit about all those mothers who'd go on about raising their kids being the hardest thing in the world. Oof. Gabe's making me start to think they had a point. <laughs> His mood swings are just, oh, I don't know. Some days I just want to leave him by the side of the road. Gee, that's good. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Jesus, obviously. You really shouldn't say things like that. I said it was a joke. It's half a joke. It's all joke. Look, I love these kids, but I could do without Gabe reminding me I'm not his mother whenever he's pissed. He's a teenager. Puberty. Hormones. The second you start getting boners, the whole world starts to get dark. What are you talking about? Sounds delightful compared to dealing with bloody underwear. <laughs> Christ. I need to get laid. <laughs> That's bad. That was an awkward transition. Sorry about that. You know, the kids can hear you. I just, no one wants to hear their parents talking about that. Stepmoms and uncles don't count. They're asleep. And besides, we're not really their parents. Still. Hmm. Ugh. What's that smell? <laughs> That's gross. We hit a skunk, go back to sleep. 
Ariana, shouldn't you be, uh, sleeping or something? I already know you guys do drugs. <coughs> That's a pretty severe way of phrasing it, Mariana. Don't tell Gabe. He's the one who told me. Oh, oh my god. You're even smoking in the car now? Alright. Everyone roll the windows down before you all get contact high. We're about to make a supply stop. That's good. So we had a bunch of exposition. That, 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 what the first 20 minutes of this game was. Exposition and meeting the characters. Which all makes sense. added a plow to of that van it would have been better if you're if there's zombies in the way instead of hitting the car against them damaging the motor I would have just added a plow <clears throat> to make it so the zombies just get pushed away you want a moment alone Mari? <laughs> I'm praying I find a candy bar. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What do we actually need? Uh, a candy bar. Need, Mariana. Not want. You heard the crowd. Please, God, let there be candy bars. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> All right. Well, let's start with some gas and move up from there. <gasps> Hello, crowbar. Wait, is that Rebecca? That's Rebecca. Well, at least the head model, anyway. Hey, where are you going? Okay, that's cool. Have fun. Oh, Jesus. It never ends with him. I hate when they fight like that. I really hate it. It's like, all Gabe wants to do is argue. Doesn't matter what it's about. Well, that makes two of us. But, we're stuck with him, so... At least you have your headphones. Yeah, but... The batteries have been dead for a couple of weeks. I mostly wear them to fool you guys. You shouldn't ignore us. You can't just ignore us, Mariana. Well, at least... Yeah, don't ignore me. <laughs> I only do it in the van. And only when things are, you know, uncomfortable. Be nice to find some dinner. In a junkyard. You never know. These past four years, people have been hoarding all kinds of shit in all kinds of places. That's true. Oh, and Mari, if there's any trouble, you can find one of these cars. Yeah? Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. And wait as long as you can. Okay. Good girl. Okay, that, that's pretty good advice I'll give. So we have to go find some, uh, okay, we have a siphon, Wazda to move around. Okay, this is weird. I'll give it that. The gaming, is, this game is a little weird. The mouse functions so slowly. Uh, talk to. Hey, any luck, kiddo? I need a pen. Or a pencil. Just something to write with. A pen? Why are you looking for that? There's just something I really want, I really need to do. And I need a pen for it. Okay. Last night I was thinking about this stupid story my mom used to tell me all the time before bed. I used to hate it. But then I realized, I don't remember the ending. It was this goofy ending she thought was so funny and I thought was so dumb. I want to write down everything I can remember about everything. 
Because if I forget, and they're all gone, I'm kind of gone too. At least a little bit. Yeah, that sort of makes I just sense. I think that might be kind of important. Maybe. That's a great idea, Mariana. And plus you could use ink for something else. Uh, let's look at the barrels. Waste oil. No use to us. Okay. Okay, so they actually did do a um, thing. So let's see. Uh, let's look at the bus. Most of the dashboard is torn out. Seats are gone. Ah, this thing's dead. Okay. Do we really want to poke this? Sure, why not? <laughs> Okay, now I'm sorry I did that. <laughs> Why would you be sorry? Think if there was a zombie under there. Okay, Kate. Look at siphon. Acetylene siphon. Okay. Can we get back to siphoning now? Where? Bit helps. That's true. Uh, storage tank. That could hold a lot of gas. Could be really handy if we stayed for a while. It's true. Uh, siphon. Come to Papa. Barely anything. I'll need to find more. Any bit helps, so tire stack. Ugh, I don't think these tires would fit the van. They would be probably better. And my keyboard keeps falling down because of these stupid stands. Here we go. <clears throat> oh, sweet, there's a third truck. Perfect. And trucks usually have good sized fuel tanks. Bingo. So I think we're good. Is there anything else? You Don't find think anything? So. I can't stop thinking about that herd. We get caught in it and, and that's it. Peace, asshole. Can't charm your way out of that one. And we'd be gone in seconds. Hey, don't think about that. We're careful. We're smart. We'll stay ahead of them. That's true. <sighs> Luck runs out just as easily as gas. There's gonna be a last one, you know? A last tank of gas. Last piece of food. What if this place is empty? And, and the next? 
And the next. We're not gonna let that happen, okay? Okay. I let it have its five minutes. Yeah, you fed the I'm beast good. pretty well there, Katie. I'll give it that. You fed that beast pretty dang well. So yeah, um, is there anything I'm missing? Um, acetylene. I already checked those. I could talk to the other kid. I still have yet to know his name. Of course, if I can. A uh, game. What's going on in there, buddy? I'm in a bad mood, okay? I want it to go away, but he won't. I just wish we weren't always on the road. I like being with other people. It's just, we're in that car so damn long. The AC hasn't worked in ages, and it, it ain't my last damn tape. Well, that's a sweet idea, but it's safer to keep moving. I don't know, maybe just leave me alone. Okay, but if you want to talk later, I'm around. Yep, the apple doesn't fall far. far the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Um, ooh, ooh, is this going to be acceptable? What are you? A container? Some sort of fuel tank. Empty too. Can't siphon that guy, can I siphon you? No. A dump truck? Nothing up there but garbage. Okay, uh, debris. Tires, paint cans, old newspaper. <sighs> All that's left in this junkyard is junk. Thing over here. I want to make sure I get everything because I know I saw that ladder. And that ladder doesn't even look sturdy enough. Too risky enough. to search up there. Doesn't look stable. Uh, can't search the debris. Can't check those boxes. I guess the... The, the, it looks risky. Looks like there's more to see up here. Any luck? Some. But not enough. Gabe? Hey, Gabe. Let's go take a look over there. Gabe, stay close to Javi. Got it? Oh, all right. So we're doing good so far, as long as no one dies, we're good. The ambulance. Look, there's one they never took to pieces. Good catch. Okay, let's look at the ambulance doors. Still might be gas in the tank, though. <sighs> Shit. It's locked. All right. Here goes nothing. Fuck yeah. Okay, there we go. That's doing good. One. Look at all that fuel. This is going to take a while. Yep, 
Is it just now feeding itself due via gravity? Shit. Looks like it came from in there. Gabe, stay close. Okay. Look. Might be able to get in through the hatch. Back out. Uh, let's enter the hole. Gabe, come check this out. Not the cleanest place. Oh, no more those at least. No dead at least, so that's good. Just be careful. Hey, batteries. <laughs> batteries. Okay, I thought that was a soda can for a second. I grabbed a soda can. Uh, bed. Oh, it looks pretty comfortable. And pretty gross. Are you kidding me? Lucky for you, they put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries. Oh, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time. Oh, check it out. This is actual honest-to-God pudding. Seriously? And it's not just food. There's a mattress. There's blankets. Someone else's mattress someone else's blankets we need to just take our gas and get on the road that's true this place does have a funny feeling about it and if muertos were to somehow surround us great now i'm officially creeped out come on one night we bunk down eat a real meal it would be nice not to sleep in the van for a change please the herd is coming if it's not here already we should go and get ahead of it before it's too late. The I'd have to agree with Kate. We'll be fine. We found this. Why can't we just enjoy it? We're gonna get what we came for and get out of here. Great. Another shitty cramp night in our shitty cramp van. <laughs> Hooray. Come on. Let's at least grab the food. Give batteries to Mario. Oh, guess what? Uh, now, you can really drown us out. <laughs> it 
Thanks for that. Backing me up and all. How does it feel to be the bad guy this time? It must be a new sensation for you. We're in it. We're in this together. Oh, oh boy, sleeping in the van again? <laughs> all I'll say is you definitely owe me one. <laughs> yeah, well, you owe me like a dozen, so I'll just shave it off your tab. Hey, Kate, can you come help us with this? Hey, uh, wait, but you... This way you can make up for being the bad guy. Thanks. Grab some gas. We need to head out soon. What the fuck do you think you're doing with our gas? Hello, people with guns. Come on, speak up! You can keep it. It's my gas now. Whoa, whoa, look, the, the gas is all there. You just keep it. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking it's a little too late for that. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I know you got people. Uh, I'm alone. No, uh -uh, I'm alone. Honestly, people just slow me down. Uh-huh. All alone. Yeah, sure you are. Fan out and look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. <sighs> hey! You assholes in there! I got your boy! You don't want him getting shot, you best come out there careful with your hands up! Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people, that shit's gonna make my day. Gee, thanks. Open it real slowly. Don't. See, I'm alone. are all open. You can't just take what you like. I don't roll over like that. I was hungry. I all those. Yeah, me. <laughs> you? By yourself? No. Yeah, what can I say? I fucking love pudding. You got a real smart mouth. Yeah, because you're... I fucking watch what you say. Look, I, I, I get it, all right? You're starving. Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. Yeah. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling <laughs> that you're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. Keep an eye on this dickhead. I'm gonna grab some cuffs. You got it. Gee, thanks. Just chill, okay? No need to make this any harder. Work this out. Your buddy's not thinking straight. So let's talk, okay? You and me, we, we can get this sorted out. No, it's his call. Look, man, this doesn't have to go. What the fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. You don't want me finding out for myself. Hey, if you're so curious, open it and find out. Hopefully they heard Go that. Go ahead. Do it. Yeah, fuck it. Are you kidding me? I thought they would have joking. Are you kidding me? I hit A. Thank you. Look, man, this doesn't have to go. What the fuck 
was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. Grab crowbar. I'll be finding out for myself. Knocked out, yes. You have to pay for what you've done here. Wait, 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 don't. Gee, thanks for pistol whipping me. Great, a zip tie. Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Hey, answer me. Answer me! Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back then. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. There's gotta be a way we can work all this out. You know, make a deal or something. It ain't my call, all right? You best be glad it ain't. Please, just s stop, all right? You don't want me riled up, kid. Not another word or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us and I'm not about to listen to you. What the heck? Stop, stop, ah, oh, shit! Yeah, I did a plow. Looking forward. Hey, that's Clem's voice. I can tell you that much. Look, I'm no threat to you, okay? I surrender. Well, that's obvious. <laughs> Seeing how you didn't shoot that guy. Okay, now don't do anything stupid. Because I'm not as nice as you. I won't hesitate. Wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Oh, shit. What do you need the truck for? To drive. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look. I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked, and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522, and, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard. 
If you let me have your van, I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. Yeah, absolutely. You got a deal. Good. Let's go. Someone had to promise that was really home. necessary. I don't know you. I don't trust you. And I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. The feeling is mutual. Are you serious? Come on. You must trust me at least a little. We're here, aren't we? I trust that if I don't get a van at the end of this, you'll regret it. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Yes, she has a scar from the school name. Clementine. Cool name. <laughs> if you say so. She has a scar from last up from when Carver hit her upside the head with not Carver, uh, the other guy who hit her upside the head with the um, rifle. Had years. Look, you don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. What's with the attitude? Come on. This whole silent loner thing you got going on? Just be real with me. I don't know what you're talking about. Muertos. The herd caught up with us. Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? <laughs> They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Usually, Don't worry about it's it. just me on my own. Apology accepted. I wasn't apologizing. <laughs> So, who's at this junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive, surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. We help each other. No, I didn't do it alone. My, uh, my, uh, Kate helped. <laughs> she did most of the work, actually. Sounds nice. Having a partner? It is. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me, too. What happened to them? Same thing that happens to everyone. I'm really shit. wishing I stayed with... We can't stay here. Lee, There's a town up ahead. Lee. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. <sighs> Lead the can way. you do that? Please? Fine. Whatever you say. Thank you. Yeah, I know. I was thinking of Kenny. Should Don't make me regret this. Come on! There, yeah. A giant. Get to the gate! Now keep going. We'll open up. Hey! Open up! I can't open the gate till you clear them out. Can't risk it. Okay, since this is a lot slower. Come on, 
Calvary. God effing damn it, Francine. One of these days, those doors are gonna close and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. <laughs> it's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind. If you want to hang on to all your teeth, that is. Okay. Now head on in. I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. <laughs> so far, so good, I guess. It's a pretty cool place, actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand... They're not my favorite. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. Hey, what's the problem? You have some sort of history here that I should know about? Not really. I just... I know what people are capable of. Uh. Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? family they're still out there if you guys made it this long I I'm sure you know you'll know what to do hopefully let's go this way I gotta see a guy about some bullets okay you know if he had made them they might not have made made for your caliber of weaponry Clementine Jeez, I haven't been in a place like this since, well, you know, it's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? Just I don't know. Social. Why don't you make some friends? <laughs> Love how Clementine's the one doing that. Okay, we can sit. Talk to. Excuse me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves. I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20 year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. <laughs> and that got a lifetime ban? Ancient history. Honestly, I don't even think about it anymore. The past is the past. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm. Don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. Uh, call. He's I'm going to guess it's call. He's got bullshit written all over him. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a fact? All right. I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip him. Oh, my. Ain't that a pretty sight? Good looking hand there. It's a race. Good looking enough. God damn it. Shit, sorry. And thanks for playing. Let me <laughs> get you a drink for the assist. On the house. <laughs> Let me get you a drink on the house. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. 
Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. oh crap. What's going on? What's the point of talking when I already told you a deal is a deal and it's done? What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah. And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Because I don't scare easy, all right? Just make it right. We can all walk away from this nice and easy. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. Oh, fucking believable Look out! Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy. I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus. You gotta get her under control, man. This ain't no way to do business. Back right, off. Stop. Seriously, this isn't getting you anything. We had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh, oh that was accidental. Oh, no. Oh, no. Drop the accidental. gun. Right now. Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You done enough talking. Drop it. Drop There's it. a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Do Okay, I gotta defend Clem. Yeah, it was just, it was just Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do with Whoa. you. Whoa! Oh, hey, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. You got some nerve coming in here fucking up my bar. Got some nerve, really? I'd have punched your fucking lights out, both of you. But Eli was a grade A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Thank you. Hey, thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um, that was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. Of course. Anytime. Well, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Hello? Of course not. Why would I think that? I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. Trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage, like you're some feral animal. Javier, pleasure's all mine. Is it now? Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. Thanks, one to know one. I've never understood it. Yeah? Well, it takes one to know one. One what? One pretty troublemaker. <laughs> I'll give you that one. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? Things got, out. Things got out of hand. Clementine was only trying to make a point, but then... You make it sound so casual. It was an accident. It's probably for you two to leave town and get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. 
There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help. Well, not that I have much to offer you, but... I know a thing or two about... I don't need you getting in trouble. I wouldn't want to make any trouble for you. This whole thing's been... Pretty messy. I hear you, but... Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. <coughs> on my terms and on my timeline. You got me? Uh, uh, we need to leave now. Nah, no way. I need to get back on the road ASAP. Javier, I'm not negotiating here. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they can need a medic. No, nah, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but, well, we could leave tonight. Slip past the herd. Get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. Uh, that sounds Maybe like trouble. Does it does sound like trouble for I'll her. I'll be right there to give it. Something tells me Trip won't be too happy about you sneaking us out the back door. He'll get pissy, but he'll get over it. Sometimes with him, you gotta ask for forgiveness rather than permission. Well, the saying is better than anyway, ask forgiveness. Think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. Yeah, the saying is better to ask forgiveness than permission. You know? I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah. She's... She's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. Uh, I'm going to go with Trip in the morning. They no should way. be able to... Trip's got more muscle, just in case. We'll wait and get a ride with him. Glad you're finally listening to reason. <laughs> Gee. You know, when I met you... I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. Gee, thanks, Clem. I think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. It's gonna be a while before that herd passes. We might as well get some sleep. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. Are we going back in time with Clementine? Or is that the end of episode one? Of season three? Hey, what you drawing there, goofball? Can I see? <sighs> you know I'm no good at this game, but I'll try to guess what it is. <laughs> is that Just AJ? Give me a second. I'll figure it out. Is it a picture of you? It's me. That AJ? Jeez. It looks just like me. Come on. Can you say Clem, AJ? Give it a try. Clem. Not much of a talker, are you, goofball? Edith says you should be speaking by now, but don't worry about it. You'll talk when you're ready. <laughs> that was weird. Clem, open up. It's me. Edith, what's wrong? The group from last week. They're back. And now they're armed. This is bad, Clem. Th th there's a lot of them. Too many of them. What? How bad is it? I don't like it? the looks of it. How bad is bad? Pack your stuff and be ready to run bad. They got a lot of cars and they're seriously pissed off. This is... Gonna get ugly. I know it. That sounded like a tank. Now pack your stuff. When I get back, we gotta get the hell out. Shit, shit, shit. Very essentials. Come on. We fucking begged you, man. Our people are Kenny's hat. starving. It's 
didn't have to be this way. You could have just given us some grub, some medicine, that's Bandages. It. This is your fault. Y'all are just hoarding it for your fucking selves. Ammo. Horseshit. Water. If you have nothing, why are you... Clem! Clem! They're inside! We have to go now! Well, that helped. That got us a good amount. Just head for, for the woods. Give me AJ. Give me AJ. So that's how she got the scar. Okay, I thought it was from the thing. So AJ's actually a few years old now. Okay, that's pretty good. So Clementine was 11, so she maybe 13, 14 now. So that's fine. Hey, Clem. We almost there. Hey, Clem. Yeah, we're close. I gotta say, I hope your people are safe and sound. Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it. Oh, yeah? Yes, sir. So that's what I'm gonna do. But why she went to bat for you, I've got no idea. I mean, she hardly even knows you. And you don't know her, for that matter. She's a good person. No, there's not much mystery to a trip. She's a good human being. Yeah. Eleanor's got a big heart. That's for damn sure. Guys, that's the place. Oh, shit. What a mess. Well, the walker's dead. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? I just saw that one coming. Mariana's tape player. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god! You're safe! I can't believe it! You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. It kept running through I'm my sorry, head like you. on a loop. I'm so sorry I left you behind. I've been trying to get back here this whole time. You don't have to be sorry. You said you'd come back, and you did. Kate and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were going to try to make it back to the van. And that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh no. No. No sign of him. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Well, Clem's not happy. Kate. They're trapped in there. Ariana, stay back.
That's one way to kill a zombie. Javi, you found us. Hey, hey, it's okay. I got you. You happy to see me? I'm happy to see all of you. Happy you're all okay. Another couple of minutes, we might not have been. But then, you showed up. Just when it really mattered. Yeah, well, that's kind of my thing. <sighs> I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. I thought we were done for. You're still alive, aren't you? <laughs> so is Kate. So is Mari. That's all that matters. <sighs> Please no death. So Please scared. no deaths. I do not want a death in this episode. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Well, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. As soon as we get back to Prescott, she'll patch you right up. I'm Trip, by the way. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. That's true. Who's the kid with the gun? Does she have a name you want to share with us? Or are you going to make me do my own introductions? Clementine's a friend. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god, Javi, do they have hot water? Even like lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? I think so. I think so. Right, Trip? <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out. I thought you'd been to this place. I have. I just. I didn't have much time to relax in my jacuzzi suite, <laughs> you know? <laughs> Between you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. But you found every single one of your people. And you found them alive, healthy, Don't reasonably it. cheerful. Well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I don't want to jinx us. Well, some things are worth saying woohoo about, that's all. That's true. Clem's not happy. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your Neither band, have I. But still. I need Don't worry. I haven't forgotten our arrangement. I know it's not the easiest thing to find, but cool. Thanks. Oh. No. Start shooting again. Kate, are you okay? I'm fine. Really? She's not. And the 
The longer it takes us to get out of here, the worse off she's gonna be. It's time to go, man. We have to get going, Hobby. Stay here and we finish this. Are you fucking nuts? We gotta get the fuck out of here I've right now. I already killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Trip help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please. Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi, please come with us. I have to, I have to stay family. with my family. Go. I'll hold him off. I said go. You. A little late for Christmas, but thank you. Oh god, I didn't want anyone to die in this episode. Kate? Kate, wake up! Kate! Kate! Oh, that was a good way to end the episode.